Hey, what's going on guys? Hopefully everybody's doing swell on this beautiful afternoon. So today guys, I'm going to introduce you to this Mitchell vehicle fan. And it's sold by joy 2 Tusks on Amazon, which I'll put a link in the description below. And these people were nice enough to send it to me for free to give my honest review. So let's take a little look at this nice box that comes in. Again, it's a Mitchell vehicle fan. You can see it has a stepless speed regulation, um, optional, but this unit does have it, so you can change the speed. And it's four and a half inches, guys, so it's kind of small, but packs a big punch, if you know what I mean. Um, it's supposed to be very quiet, and you can see the nice picture, um, just relaxing. You know, you want to stay cool and beat the heat, guys. You know, maybe, you know, you're going to the lake and you want to eat a pretzel, listen to some 80s music. You know, you don't want to have your AC cranking, or maybe your AC doesn't work. You know, then you plug in the little fan, you know, and you do a, you do pretty good with that. So, again, it comes in a 24-volt or a 12-volt. I have the 12-volt, which is good for small cars, you know, and you can use it for trucks, boats, maybe an RV, all that good stuff. Let's take a look at the box, guys, see what it's saying. It's saying that it's environmentally protection, energy saving, safety, and it comes with a one-year warranty. Also, long power line. And let's take a look at the back. And you can see there's all these different models it comes with. Mine's all the way on the right. And then the last side here just gives you some more information, guys, telling you it's multifunctional use, um, you know, for some summer cooling. So we're going to open this up, guys, and see what we got. All right, all right. Okay, guys, so now let's see what we got in the goodie box. And everything in here, guys, was actually very nicely in plastic bags. I took them out so I can show you guys. So this is the bracket, guys. This is for the back seat. So this is going to go back here. And say you got some kitties or you got some passengers in the back seat, you want to keep them cool, well, then you're actually just going to put the fan back there. So that's great. Very convenient. And then we got the standard suction cup, which you guys probably know. You know, they use them for GPSs. And that's actually going to go on your windshield like so. And now we got the actual fan because you kind of need the fan, right, guys? So it looks very cool, very clean, as you can see. I love the small, compact size. And then we have the power here. And as you can see, it's going to have an on-off dial. And then here's the little plug cord for your cigarette lighter. So as you know, that's going to go in there. Okay, guys, so now I'm going to show you how to hook up the fan. So you just turn the fan to the side. You go in the back, and you see you got this little thread here, this little nut. You're just going to take that off. It comes off nice and easy like so. Then you grab the suction piece part, and it's got the little ball. You're just going to put that through there. And then you just pop this in with the ball like so. Pops in. All right, then let's just screw this little nut back on. Okay, guys, so now that you got the fan put together with a suction cup like so, you're going to find a desired spot on the window. So just push it there, guys. Pretty good. And you got the lever. I'm doing this with one hand, but use a little force. See, now we're good to go. And you can move the fan in your desired spot when you want to be cool. So we're going to plug in the power cord right here into the socket. And you can see this already lights up, which is great. This is the dial. We're going to turn it on. It's got that nice little light on the bottom. Lights up. Dial lights up. That's cool. Wow. And that's actually a great breeze, guys. You can go higher on the lever there. Wow, if you put it up to the max, guys, that really cools you down like an air conditioner, maybe even better. Um, and then if you just want a little bit, just tone it down a little bit. Very cool, guys. Like, if you got a busted AC or the AC is not on strong enough, I mean, this is convenient, guys. You could just sit in your car, relax, be cool. Wow. I like it. I like it. 
Okay, guys, so now we're the backseat driver. You know, we're saying, hurry up, let's go. I want my tacos, but I want to be cool while in the back seat. So let me show you how that bracket works for the back. Again, you got the little washer tightener there around the circle. And we're just going to put it right behind the driver's seat. Going to go to the right. So you guys got these little hooks. Let me show you close. You know, you got the hooks on each side. So you just put the hook on the one side. And then we got the left. Okay, so now it's on. We want to tighten it. So just roll the knob, we go clockwise, that side's good. And then we got the right side. Just tighten that. Then we got the fan. We're just gonna pop it in guys, just like we did on the front. Okay, let me show you. Just pop that in. Hear that click. And then we got the nut. We just wanna tighten that. Again, guys, this is very simple. Um, with two hands, it's even easier. So I'm trying to record this for you guys with one hand. Now and then you just put it up to your desired position. And we already have it plugged in. You can see the cord, guys. I'm going to turn it on. All right. So now we're going to be in the back seat. Wow, nice and cool. You got all the air hitting your chest, hitting your face, maybe you want it up a little higher towards your head. I mean, that's great, guys. Now you're actually cool in the back seat. Feels great. Okay, guys, so that's it for my video. Hopefully you enjoyed the demonstration. And I highly recommend this, guys. If you want to stay cool in the summertime, maybe your air conditioner doesn't work, maybe you want to double up the air. I mean, this is incredible breeze, nice and cool. So I'll put a link in the description below where you guys can purchase on Amazon. Currently only $15, guys. You can't go wrong with that. So any comments or questions, leave them in the comment box below. And as my friend Matt says on average watch reviews, you always have time to be kind. All right, all right.